Welcome everybody to Bedbug TV. I'm your host, Jeff White. And in today's episode, I actually wanted to have a little bit of fun with the uh, subject and talk about the effect of blood alcohol content and how that affects the amount of blood bedbugs take when they're feeding. And uh, what happened recently was the uh, University of Nebraska at Lincoln conducted a study where they added different levels of alcohol to blood and tracked how that affected or changed the amount of blood that bed bugs took. And what they found was that the higher the blood alcohol content of the blood, the uh, less blood that the bed bugs actually took, and therefore the fewer amount of eggs that bed bugs laid. Um, obviously a very interesting study. Um, you know, the, the part of it though that people are a little bit cautious of is that, you know, people are going to see this study and say, well, I've got bed bugs and if I can reduce the amount that they're laying eggs and the blood that they're taking from me, I'm going to start drinking. And, you know, every night before people go to bed, they're going to have a few glasses of scotch or wine or beer. And listen, I like a good glass of scotch or beer as much as the next guy. And I don't necessarily always need a reason to have a, a glass of scotch or wine. As far as I'm concerned, it's afternoon, so uh, have at it. But we don't want people to take this information the wrong way. You know, this did not show that drinking alcohol before you sleep, before bed bugs feed on you, you know, it's going to solve your problem. Um, the bugs are still going to feed. It didn't even suggest that they're going to bite less. They just may take less blood when they actually withdraw blood from you. There still be, may be the same, say, three bites when you wake up if you drink before versus you don't drink. They didn't look at that in the study. Um, and it's not going to prevent them from laying eggs. They just may reduce less eggs. And so, you know, I don't want people to see the study and say, well, you know, that's it. I'm, I'm going to drink before I go to sleep and, and that's going to help me with my bed bug problem. Um, interesting study, an amusing study, I think it was cool, but, you know, don't want people to take this the wrong way. So you know the email address, jeff.white at bedbugcentral.com. If you have any questions on this topic or any other, please feel free to email me. And, uh, to say cheers to this topic, because, uh, you know, anytime we talk about alcohol, I'm always, uh, up for that. To say cheers to this topic, you know, have a quick sip of a good glass of scotch, and, uh, I hope to see everybody soon enough.